Dermot, the games are coming thick and fast and tomorrow evening we, uh, we face Colchester after a fantastic win on Saturday. Yeah, really nice weekend for everyone. I hope um, back to a tough game. I, I really think it's a, uh, we had a real tough game uh, in the trophy and uh, I think uh, we've got to be, have our wits about us. We're the strongest side, if I'm honest, since uh, that game. So, but I still think it'll be a very tough game. They got beat on Saturday, so they'll be looking for a reaction as well. You know. Absolutely. You mentioned Saturday. There it was a long trip on Saturday. Yeah. And it was a fantastic place, a difficult place to go, and fantastic to get a result. Yeah, I think I think it is. I think they do. I think a good side. More come all this uh, where they're going to end up and where we're going to end up. They they really worked hard in midfield. Uh, very good in, on their uh, diagonal play. And they could have gone in front on the goal, it was a bit dubious, but you know, we've we done really well to win there. It was a very good trip, great trip back. Addock and chips and sausage and chips with the chaps, done by Mark, he's allowed that this week if we win. So it was really no better feeling than being on the coach coming back. And you mentioned uh, on Saturday after the game that it was a team performance. That I think speaks volumes about the boys considering it's a new group, doesn't it, to Absolutely. go away like that? And staff, I have to say the staff and the club, I say that because you know Matt and I are very engaging people. We don't sort of, we won't walk past anyone without making a comment, whether it's a little joke or some humour or a hello and I think that's really important and um, I want the players to be like that, respectful and get on with one another. And it's not easy when you've got like 20 young men like together. They, you know, they, they've had their little t tiffles and sort of thing, but they're, in general, I'm really, really pleased with the whole spirit of the club. And the fans were singing your name and, and really? songs about the, the players on Saturday oh, as well, good. the ones that travelled, so that must please okay. you as well. It was polite, was it? Don't yeah, like it, was all, it was all clean, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I love that. I love, I, I, it's one of those said we didn't know we had so many songs, because there's a few songs coming. And I think you've got to uh, put in the performances. You know, you've got to, we want to win and we want to play well. And, you know, the, the, when we're free to up, it's exciting, you know, and the ball goes in there box and, and I think that's what you pay for you know you don't want to go to Morecambe and see us sit behind the ball and not have a shot I, I couldn't coach like that if I'm honest and I really I was really pleased that the fans have had a good time um, and long may it continue he scored two against Luton scored three on Saturday five goals in two games is it a sign that think, not necessarily starting to click but we are finding the goals and James Collins is on a good I run as well I think it's starting to click because what I was trying to say about the two up front I do play if we play through the third, you get Billy has got to get closer, or the, the top man, the wide man has to come in from one side where the ball is and, and join with James Collins or the number nine with a fullback going on. So it's, a, it's not a rocket science way of playing, but if James can't hold the ball up, or if the passes break down, you don't get that. And you can put the ball into two people on their heads, but it's just not what I want to do, you know. So it's clicking, I think. Cabby's come in, Billy, Jimmy Smith now, for me, is that was his best game. You know, he, he wasn't chasing after the ball. And, and, and he was playing with his brain, scores a great goal, he's in the box, we ain't gone box to box to get it, you know, we built the play up. So it's very interesting when we talk about these players, that when you put players with players of the same like, they, they raise their game, raise their class. And just finally, tomorrow evening, what are you expecting from Colchester? What sort of threat did they pose in the game last month and what are you expecting tomorrow? Um, well, I just think physically they're a very strong side. Um, we, we, we've handled that, but I actually think we... You know, it's a, it, we're into the second game with a three on this, this seven-day period. We've got to keep the ball um, against them. I think that we don't want them getting set plays and getting in behind us. You know, we've got to stretch them and, and take the game to them rather than let them come at us.